All right, Chase Shot Blast here. What's happening? We are <clears throat> about to get wrecked. Apparently, I was not expecting this. Uh, Your life ends now. Sorry, I'm in the zone. Uh. Alright, so before I was really interrupted by these jerk faces, uh, <laughs> we are trying to meet back up with Sigurd. That's probably unnecessary. Ooh, we got a deer hoof. Um, so. And we are going to, uh, we're gonna take out this little mercenary business. If you were watching the last video, you will have seen that this wench was trying to haggle us for money. And it didn't really work out for her. Now it's really going to not work. But anyway, thanks to Ubisoft for providing me with this review copy of the game. And not going finally, to we found... Just keep your wits about you. Call me, Ivar. Me and Aver will take care of this. I know. Sigurd, is there a problem? We'll go see Tomna. Just the two of us. Ivar and Uba will wait here. Better if Tomna thinks we've come alone. The truth is, I don't think any of us can stop Eva from cleaving her head open. It's all he was spewing the whole way over here. Right. Shall we? We'll return shortly. A small fortune for whoever sent Tona to hell. I'll hold you to that. From what I overheard in Repton, the brothers had an arrangement with Tona. What happened? She's a mercenary. Uba used her for man and information. But well, that relationship soured now that Burgret is all but defeated. From what I heard, Tana has hunger for two things. Soft silver, and a stern hump. Neither of which earns you true loyalty. If she can't be trusted, what use is she? That is for us to find out. We may be able to satisfy her. And if we can't? Eva did tell you to bring her axe. <laughs> all right, so... As expected. If she takes a liking to you, keep talking. She's more your type, I think. No, no. Sigurd, what brings you strolling into my camp this brisk day? I suspect you already know. Yes. The embers on the air betray you. And yet, if you are here talking to me, King Burgered remains at large. And who are you, lovely dove? Want to perch your ass on my lap? Not interested. And why not? I've been told I have a rather expert tongue. Only good for yawping, I see. <laughs> Enough blabbering. You know why we're here. Where is King Burgret? That is what you want. And what makes you think I have the slightest idea? We found letters. Records of trade. The two of you have a history. What can I say? The king pays well for my services. If only I could say the same for those two Ragnarsson clots. You're dealing with me now. And I want to know what you know. Name your price. Very well. I could use another cow. And you can cover the cost. You take me for a fool. I take you for desperate beggars. I can smell it on you like dung heap. Now that's my price. What say you? You heard me the first time. But I'll get what I need, one way or another. No, no. You have shot your chance. And if you show your faces around here once more, I will tear you limb from limb. 
Well, that is not the result I was hoping for. I hope you have another idea. Tona keeps a close eye on whoever she deals with. If Berkford is keeping records, so is she. Somewhere behind those walls. See what you can find. I'll go back to the brothers. Keep those gates locked. If they come within a foot of you, kill them! I'm kind of fine with just going in and killing everybody. Ooh, there's armor in there. I mean, I kind of feel like I can... ...probably just kill them all. <laughs> What secrets you keep, Tona? This might be something. Looks like Berkrit wants big Tona to steer the Ragnarsons away from two areas. Berkrit's private haunts, perhaps. He could be at either one. Shouldn't have been so greedy, Tona. Right, back to the brothers. It's not going after those two items, but I want to keep this uh, story driven. All right, where are they? They're down here. <sighs> no fast travel place, dang it. I worked so hard to get fast travel in. <laughs> uh, that's a bad idea. Now we're probably just going to storm the village anyway. Hey, 
Eivor, tell us you learned something. Let a Chester and Templebroth fought. What do you know about them? Hmm. Lederchester is a large village, and Templebroch, it's an old military fort, not much else. Burkred could be at either one. We should check both, as soon as possible. And what do we do with Tana? I would bet the sweat off my sack she's writing to Burkred now, offering silver for a warning about us. Let me worry about that. We should get moving, Drinkit. I can take the fortress of Templebroch. I will join you, Sigurd. That leaves me led the Chester thing. All by my fucking lonesome. And your friend, brother. Maybe Eivor dares to be called that. Go on ahead. I'll catch up with all of you soon. Well, that was a bit of a letdown. Didn't even really get that much uh, XP out of it. So. All right, uh, so wants us to go all another place with no fast travel I like literally don't have any fast travel anywhere near there uh, or I don't even have this place either go here and do Ivar's task first so those are the the two ones that we have to worry about Probably go to Repton and then just travel over to there. So anyway, hope you guys enjoyed. This is a little bit of a short one, but we'll see ya.